Hello everyone, Annie Scano and greetings. My name is Kim Richardson and I am president of Transrep Inc. Though we are gathering from far and wide, I would like to begin by recognizing the place that brings us all together today. We acknowledge that Mont Hill Golf and Country Club is situated on the traditional ter territory of the Hanashi and Ashabi nations within the lands protected by the Dish with One Spoon Wampum Agreement and is currently home to many indigenous people from across Turtle Island. For many years, Transrep Inc. has been a big part of bringing new services and products to the transportation industry and now working with West Hill in the golf industry as well. I want to extend my thanks to my technical team and my commercial team. You guys are all awesome. Um, these guys are doing some pretty amazing things in the transportation world, truly using everything they have to make it. So what makes us any different between some of these? And in one short sentence, we're the first to integrate solar electromobility in a clean, simple, and powerful way. It's not just about solar panels, it's what one does with the power. We have the largest power potential per square foot of area known to us, which is extremely robust, impact resistant, which it would have to be for golf, and lightweight composite technology. There's a lot of what you don't see under the hood, if you will. Sunrunner is just as the name suggests, using the power of the sun to keep batteries consistently charged, in turn providing continuous power to the electric motor on the car quick. Um, the first time it went out, I was actually kind of nervous for some reason, like the golf cart was going to blow up. Um, but we know that's clearly not the case. So it came back, everything was good, um, the numbers were impressive, it needed some calibration, John was back and forth, and we got it finally dialed in, and it went out again, and I saw the members had come back in, they'd gone and ate lunch, I went over to check the golf carts myself, and I was floored, just like Gina showed the numbers, it had been out there for four and a half hours, and the battery had gone down 5%. Typically, after a round of golf, it would be down 40, 45%, but it was down 5%. And we saw these numbers over and over again, and it didn't matter if it was sunny, if it was cloudy, um, it just kept repeating itself. Right, where you can say, oh, it's gonna be 15 to 18% range, range extension. But thinking about it, it's probably going to be more because it's constantly part. It, it's it's a off-grid mobile charger. It's constantly charging, and the beauty of it is, it's a slow charge. Like talk about a holistic.